Alright, what's going on guys? It's Valrico here, and today we're going to be continuing on with the Hitman 2016 Let's Play. So without further ado, let's get into the action. Good morning, 47. We have a lead on the Shadow Client. ICA White Hats have traced the anonymous data received by our clients to one Olivia Hall, brilliant young hacktivist and suspect in a dozen cases of cyber vandalism. Using onion routing with state-of-the-art encryption, Hall went to a lot of trouble to stay untraceable. She is good, but we are better. Her digital trail has led us to a remote farm in Colorado, where satellite footage has revealed what appears to be the training camp for a private militia, led by an already registered target, Sean Rose, Australian environmental terrorist and explosives expert wanted for a series of public bombings. Rose was spotted near the scene of Thomas Cross's kidnapping, which makes him our prime suspect for the Shadow Client. Spurred by Eric Soders, the ICA Board of Directors has asked us to infiltrate the farm and eliminate Sean Rose, along with three other prominent militia members. Ezra Berg, retired Mossad interrogator. Penelope Graves, former Interpol anti-terror analyst. And finally, Maya Parvati, former assassin and gunrunner for the Tamil Tigers. I'll be honest with you, 47. I consider Eric Soda's reasoning hasty and ill-advised. Now, we cannot go against the wishes of the board, but we can conduct our own investigation. Whether a direct threat to the ICA or not, we need to know the Shadow Client's true agenda. I will leave you to prepare. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Tactical suit. Uh, let's go with a lock pick. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Welcome to Colorado, 47. The militia has taken up HQ at an old apricot farm and appear to be training for a series of coordinated strikes, ranging from cyber attacks to full-blown guerrilla warfare. The Shadow Client appears to unite specialists and radicals from all over the map. Mercenaries and terrorists, hackers and spies joined by an unknown common cause. Satellite scans indicate that the command room is below ground inside an old tornado shelter. Only Rose appears to have access, however, so to get inside, you will need to get creative. This environment is hostile and highly alert, so tread carefully. Good luck, 47. talking about I was just at the security station watching the feeds there's this creepy guy interrogating the hostage where's it really printed man oh yeah that must be bird oh yeah man his interrogation techniques totally just out of box I could say drugs that kind of thing but uh none of the rough stuff now they don't like to mark up their patients so to speak yeah, those massage boys like things Chemical and 
What? Command, thought I heard something. Checking it out. Over. coin and a gun okay everyone step back go ahead and save right here Mm, that's a guy we gotta kill. That is Sean Rose, terrorist, ter insurgent. Let's see. Mm. Charge is too weak. Mix another batch of gel. This time, add another 5% of nitroglycerin. Sure thing, Sean. I need the mixture to be precise. Contents of the safe cannot be damaged. When you're done, text me. And I'll come by and check you haven't created something that will blow us all to kingdom come. That is all. Alright, so let's just uh, walk around and scope the area out.
Where'd he take the body? Ah, oh, he took it in there. Oh, you were at Jordan Cross's funeral. Sir, you're trespassing. Please, you need to turn around now. Yeah, keep going. He took it in there Try and I can't get to it. To you. you know what I'm saying? Fire will! Fire will! Yeah. They ain't talking to me, are they? I done walked off. And dump that. Whoa. That is Maya Parvati, Sri Lankan assassin turned pirate turned insurgent. Hell, she just walked right into me. Maya Parvati is down. Good work. We'll take that. <laughs> she just walked right into me. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. I think I can walk around with a machine gun. I'm not sure. Jordan Cross's funeral. You're trespassing. Please turn around, sir. That's, That's good, fuck. sir. Keep going. It's funny. Thinking about it. A 
weapon shows you who you really are. Either you press that trigger and stand up for yourself, or you don't, right? I'm losing you, man. No, it's more than a weapon like that. It's a relationship. Until death do us part. Oh, yeah? What about the horse? You've got the horse already. Seriously, man. You need a vacation. Take it easy. Intriguing. According to Graves' ledger on Sean Rose, he is hypersensitive to the effects of drugs, in particular, hallucinogens. Last time he tried, it triggered a nasty psychotic episode, channeling his fear of germs. Interestingly, the ledger also contains a record of his most recent OCD attacks. Desk, grandfather clock, and faucet. Hmm. Rose appears to smoke cigarettes when he gets agitated. What if... Semper Paratus. That is Penelope Graves, acclaimed anti-terror analyst. Strange to see her as part of this crowd. Hey there. Hmm. I'm, um, Penelope Graves, the new analyst. So I've got my first real meeting with Sean Rose in a few. Anything you think I should know about him? Well, to be honest, he gives me the creeps. I don't much appreciate his methods. I'm more of a see the whites of their eyes kind of soldier. Remote bombings just seem, I don't know, wrong. And the others? Okay, here's a scenario. Say a perp is getting away. Right? He's running the best he can. Let's say he's shot or something. So would you tase him in the neck slash face? Take that on the neck. No trespassing behind ah, this point. Fuck. This is your first warning. I was this close to emptying a clip in you. You are very lucky to be alive. Not have clearance. Turn around now. Hey, you didn't hear me? Sir, move along. For him to turn around, they're talk talking to each other through the fucking window.
Oh. Nobody heard nothing. I also checked that. Listen, I appreciate your interest in my work, but it's a little hard to focus on all these questions. No problem. I'm just a kid. It's really something else. Is that so? Absolutely. Not the violent kind. Beating people up, uh, electricity, and breaking bones. That's it, it isn't my deal at all. Uh, no, more like the, the subtle stuff. Subject talk. Oh, got it. If this guy could fuck off with his little uh, Michael Myers mask and shit, like, what is he doing? Oh my god. Let the subject talk. Hey, yeah, this guy. I don't know. There we go, he's fucking off. Yeah, let's see. Hey, you. A lot of intel in here. You know what? If I loosen this, he might blow himself up. So let's, uh, wrench. Ezra Berg is the guy in the, uh, the red flannel, and uh, when he comes back in, uh, when he comes back around, we'll uh, lace his shit. Hopefully he smokes a cigarette too, because let's see what happens. Uh -huh. 
If not, if I can't kill him with the smoke or whatever, this for plan A, I'll just climb through the window and shoot the son of a bitch. His ass come back around. It's him right there. Soldier. Yep, he smokes. Your boy with the fucking flannel smokes. So hopefully he'll go in there, light a cigarette, and blow himself up. Uh, keep an eye on him right now. Uh-oh. Here we go. That is Ezra Berg, former Mossad interrogator. His services are in demand at the moment. There he comes. does. Fuck it. I guess he doesn't smoke, so he's not gonna smoke right there. I can fix. Okay, so this goes to that, and that goes to this. Up and running again, thanks to me. What's up? Uh, do you much? So what are you really up to? <laughs> Fuck, they caught me. That is Ezra Berg, former Mossad interrogator. His services are in demand at the moment. 
quite bewildering that is. Ezra Berg has been reunited. Good work, 47. Good work, 47. Basement key. Lethal poison. Alright. So, had enough of Ezra Berg and his shit. AKA looking like motherfucking Michael Myers. The grunts are here. Okay. You are free to engage anyone you don't know. Just fire away. Affirmativo. Guess it was nothing. Woo-wee! <laughs> like a doctor. Let's go ahead and save that right there. <laughs> that was such a small window to lace the cigarette for Sean, Pro whatever his name is, Sean. Price, Sean Penn, who good fucking knows? Whatever his name is. Right. So now what do we do? Wait for this guy to smoke a cigarette? For fuck's sake. Trigger Sean's OCD. Oh, we gotta go this way.
All right, let's go ahead and save right here. He's already looking at the clock down there. <laughs> Should be coming up the stairs now. Yeah, here he comes. Is Sean Rose, terrorist turned insurgent? Two, three. We made him freak the fuck out. Watch him die. I don't think he's going to die. I think he's going to get hallucinated. Freaking the fuck out. This is, this is bad. Oh, oh, geez, geez, I'm covered. Oh, oh, covered in all. Oh, God. Oh, God. They're, they're everywhere. Oh, get them off. Get, get them off. I, 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 I'm clean. I'm, I'm clean. I gotta get, I gotta get it off. I get it off. <laughs> he 
Drowned the shit out of it like a savage. <laughs> Holy fuck, that was great. That shit was great. Oh, her room's at the farm, okay. Trespassing. Violators will be shot and survivors will be shot again. You were lucky. We could have shot you, you know. Huh. You know what? I gotta go back and get his goddamn outfit. Are here. Oh, he doesn't have an outfit. Shit. Gotta get into her room. Get to her room, I can kill her. It's gonna be a, uh, a bit of a situation. So this test has planned. Seems kind of cruel, doesn't it? I mean, listen. I'm no softy or anything, but it feels excessive to me. She's got it coming. Penelope Graves is still new to this outfit, and it looks like Rose is going to test her dedication to the cause. He's arranged for one of the communications technicians to act as an outside agent. The tech is supposed to show her an Interpol badge and escort her to the slurry pit, asking her to betray the militia. Might I suggest a last-minute recasting, 47? Nobody could switch sides like Graves and just expect to be accepted. Tests are in order, man. Yeah, sure, I get that.
Oh my god. So now I gotta get his badge. How am I supposed to get it? There's no way I'm going to be able to get to that. How am I supposed to get to that? There's no way. No fucking way. There's another thing that drives me crazy. It's this cat. Penelope Graves, Aha. acclaimed anti-terrorist. Alright, he drinks. Strange we're gonna rat poison him. Part of this crowd. Ooh, Penelope? Oh, okay. We're gonna have to wait for her to fuck off first. We don't wanna alert her. We don't wanna alert her. We're gonna watch where this body goes and we're gonna steal the fucking whatever he's got. Although he might drop it where he dies. But, uh, wait for her to fuck off. Nothing. All right, all right. Let's wait for this guy to come back. Well, he'll die. on back buddy get you a little gulp of that bruh <laughs> all right let's get position oh yeah here we go sure just wait a minute 
try it again. There's a last on my list. Yeah, Penelope Graves, last one. Go ahead and get a gulp of that. It's not gonna kill him, but and what is the metal taste? I wonder. Oh god, that is that's awful. Excellent, excellent. Penelope Graves. We need to talk. You're... Uh... What is this? I'll explain everything at the slurry pit. It will be in your best interest to do as I say. I understand. I have to say, it. Oh, you were at Jordan Cross's funeral, huh? Uh, I was at the... Graves, you are being recruited back into Intermol as an insider. What? I... Who are you anyway? How did you find me? That is not important. Think about this carefully. You could provide us with valuable intel. If you cooperate, the agency will overlook your unfortunate transgression. <sighs> and what if I refuse, huh? If I scream and get the guards here? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Might prove unhealthy. I'll give you a few moments to think about it. Good work, 47. This should give her something to think about. Okay, listen guys, I appreciate your dedication, but please can you just let me have some alone time? I've got to focus and it's, well it's not easy with an entourage, okay? Thank you. Ah. <laughs> Think, Grave. How did they get to you? Flight out of Lyon under assumed name. Passport provided through Delgado and that vanisher guy. Made it look clean. What? Targets taken care of. Now gain access to the tornado shelter. 
<laughs> gave her a shove, bro. <laughs> what? That was crazy. I gave her the old shove dooski. She fucking landed in the oil slick and died. my objective? I forgot. It appears the door to the tornado shelter is protected by a biometric lock. To gain access, you need Sean Rose's body, or something equally convincing.
something equally convincing. Fucker still ain't dead yet. So, uh, where am I supposed to get this convincing? So you know how Rose keeps his desk tidy like a Japanese garden, right? Got him, coach. No, he's still not dead. Someone left in a hurry. Sean Rose was not the Shadow Client. That much is clear. Whoever commands the militia, they got out just in time. Look around, 47. We're getting closer. Look around, 47. Some kind of network. Power plants. From all sectors. Familiar faces, too. Thomas Cross. Klaus Strandberg, Ether, and that's missing banker Eugene Cobb. Well, well. There's a name. Providence. What? No. No, it can't be. The Hidden Hand. Thought they were a myth. A hypothesis, nothing more. The idea that a small cabal of kingmakers, controlling enough corporate and political leaders, could effectively run the world in secret. Maybe not Illuminati. so hypothetical. Keep Bilderberg. We need full disclosure. Someone's done their homework. Look how far it dates back. Hayamoto, Beldingford, Delvade. The Shadow Client has been tracking you for decades. Now how is that possible? It isn't. 
Every one of those missions were branded as unsolved or accidents. He must have been looking for a pattern, a certain M.O., which would mean... He knows me. Well, at least this shortens the list. something. So does. But that would mean... Providence has infiltrated ICA. And Eric Sodas is their operative. Bastard! It all fits! He was the one who persuaded the rest of the ICA board to greenlight this operation. This changes everything. Get out, 47. We got what we came for. What about the Shadow Clan? He is no longer our primary concern. ICA has been compromised. I always wondered if Providence was real, but I never actually... I will need to confer with the board, but mark my words, 47. This will have consequences. Bam! Rose is gone. It was me, wasn't it? They tracked me. I don't believe it. I took every precaution. Rose knew the risks. They all do. You did well, Olivia. I am proud of you. Now listen. The ICA knows about you. They kept you alive because they needed you, and now they don't. We won't talk again. Not until the storm is over. I don't like it. This man, you know what he's capable of. You need to end this now. I ran away as a boy. My friend and I, away from that place. We came upon a small farming community. The people were dirt poor, but this woman, she took us in. We were awakened the next morning by the shots. A dozen people lay face down in the snow. Our warden didn't like to leave witnesses. They shot the woman and her family last. They made sure that we watched the whole thing. This is your gift, the warden told us. Your gift and your curse. Touching lives only by ending them. You know him. Better than anyone. Oh, shit. <laughs> 